We've made it to the Magic Kingdom for some nighttime fun. We're actually gonna be dining at one of the best places to dine inside the Magic Kingdom. Be Your Guest restaurant. We are going. And obviously we've got Casey and Alexa back in the vlogs. What's up, girls? Hi. Alexa? What's up? Hey. Hi. Hi. Hello. You got anything to say to anybody? Um, it's a beautiful evening. We're gonna have some fun. We're gonna do something really yummy today. I already told him. Oh. Surprise. <laughs> All right, it's like my first time in a long time actually just using my phone. Oh, it works. I got it set up finally. Oh, it's the first time in like okay. two years I've done it. Uh, pull that back. Try tapping that magic again. Thank you. You know, it's spooky right now, but I kind of got a feeling the next time we're going to be here, it's going to be a whole lot of Christmas. So enjoy our last look at Halloween because come November 1st, we will be inside the park checking out the Christmas decorations. Also, this is cool. Look at them. Now, tonight is kind of just like a vibe night being inside the Magic Kingdom, but however, we're trying to get on Thunder before or be your guest restaurant reservation. So we're gonna probably beeline to Big Thunder right now. We wanted to go on Thunder because Dad's not here and we want to scream Dad. So that's why we're kind of heading out over there. Until next year, Christmas. I'm oh, sorry, why did I say Christmas? Until next year, Halloween decorations. Farewell pumpkins. Hello Christmas tree. I think we got a cavalcade coming down here. Oh, you guys see the sunset on the castle? Oof! Isn't that beautiful? It's so pretty. It's the extra glow. Tonight is obviously not a Halloween party night, so if you come in the future on a Halloween or a Christmas party, not night, when there's not a party, it's gonna be a zoo, and it's a zoo here tonight. Also, you realize I'm not wearing a hat? It feels so weird. It is weird seeing you without a hat. Yeah. It's like the only time you ever don't wear a hat is when you just get your hair cut. <laughs> what parade is this? It's a cavalcade. Oh my gosh, I almost got ran over. This is what I mean by I don't think the crowds are gonna be really low until the new year. We're getting on to the busy months of the year. It's so good to be back. I feel like I was just here though, because this looks like Disneyland. I feel like I haven't been here in forever. We're on the wrong side of the road, Kyle. Really? What's the time? Look at Alexa cruising, leading the way. There's Casey. Very rarely do I even show this, but I love when you walk through this breezeway and you just see the mansion. Is that night iconic? Is that night iconic or what? Like, look at that. All right, so we thought Thunder wasn't gonna be an actual 45, but it really is. We have time. We have time. We need to do this for Dad. And obviously, Alexa wants to. Yeah. Totally. <laughs> We really cannot walk. It is it is a night here. There's a lot of people who are wearing Halloween costumes tonight, even though it's not a party. I already saw the Sanderson sisters. I saw Barbie. I wanted to be like, hi Barbie, but we, we didn't cross paths. Um, yes, lots of folks in Halloween costumes. Alexa loves walking, guys. <laughs> here we go. 45 minutes for thunder. Yeehaw! Let's see how long it actually does take. I have a really good game to play right now. And the game is called Alexa, hold out your hand. No, I'm out. Hold out your hand? No. Just hold out your hand. Reach for the stars. No, hold it out. It is, I am holding it out. All right, balance, balance. No. <laughs> Casey, hold out your hand. What is this? Hold out your hand. No, 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 no. <laughs> I have no, no, no. I'm going to try it. Stop. <laughs> Ellen wants to take over the vlog. Oh, that's, I thought you just wanted me to hold it. Oh, no. Yeah, she, that's okay. why Alexa, Alexa already knew. She's like, I'm done, I'm done. Looks like, it's been a long day. We, we, we've already been in Typhoon Lagoon, and she is timed out. We're a little teeny, tiny 
tiny bit worried about the line because we do have dinner reservations, but hopefully it moves quickly. I feel like once we get inside, it can, it will be smooth. What do you think? Lex is hungry and just wants to dine with the beast. I just really want some steak. I want some French onion soup. I think... I mean, we're moving pretty fast, but I'm pretty sure we're going to get a night coaster ride here at Thunder, unfortunately. It's been 10 minutes? We got this. It's okay. It's okay. The only problem is the lightning lane is so backed up. Here's a quick look at Tiana's as well. I still got to do an update on that. Do you guys know me? Do you guys know me? Gotta play best fiends in line. Best time waster there is. We're moving slowly, but consistent. We've got about 30 minutes until our reservation. 30 minutes. It hasn't been bad, and I feel like there is light at the end of the tunnel. Once we, now my new, my next target is once we get down here, this will be, will be golden. Unfortunately, we did not beat the sunset. Wah. I personally like it better in the dark anyway. I think it's more fun. For the record, the line at 7.30 is uh, little to no line. Honestly, the wait time was pretty spot on. 45 minutes. Not bad at all. And we're going to make it probably on time to uh, be our guest or $70 per person dinner. All and we get the back. Heck to the yeah. It's the wildest ride in the wilderness. Ditto. We're about to scream Casey's ear off, unfortunately. Sorry, Casey. Here we go! Woo! Everybody scream! Dad? No, I didn't. Why? Because I was like, you guys have your moment. <laughs> <laughs> but I was there in support. She was. <laughs> and we're back, just like that. That was a good ride. This is way more wild when you're in a row by yourself. I just had a hiccup. <laughs> Alright, I really think riding at night might be my new time favorite. That was fun. That was fun. I've also been on the ride when fireworks are going off, and if you can like somehow time that perfectly, that is a, that is a treat. Magical. Also, a pro tip is to do this, well, if you do the Halloween party, this ride you can go on like three times in a row. Just keep going and going at night, and it's amazing. Pretty empty over here now. Fireworks are about to begin. We're actually watching the fireworks. Or sorry, <laughs> we're having dinner during the fireworks. Inside though, obviously we won't be able to watch them. Looks like at night they actually keep the work lights on for a splash if you guys wanna come and take a peek. Oh, the lights are on. You can actually see it way better at night than during the day at some points. Like, look at that. Wow though, look at this. Kinda looks fake. That's pretty. 
Alexa, have you seen the moon? This is my second time seeing the moon, ever. It's amazing. It's crazy, right? Have you guys right? ever seen this before? We don't have moons in Wisconsin. <laughs> it's weird. It's so funny. <laughs> it's pretty vibey over here right now at the moment. Wow, look at the moon now. Did you just see thunder? Wait, there was yeah. thunder on. I just saw that too. On the mansion. Usually only does that during the party. I spy Alexa and Casey. I ditched them. Oh, I thought you guys were gonna keep walking by me, honestly. No, we saw you. We have our eyes on you. Wowzers, they actually brought all the uh, construction over here now. That means this side is probably done. Oh, just kidding. The whole thing is under refurbishment now. Look at how cool this looks. I know it's just a moon, okay? It's just a moon, but inside but the no, Magic Kingdom, it's- it's not just a moon. It's a moon and a star. Oh yeah, you guys can't see the star. This is, remember, this is Alexa's second ever moon that she's ever seen. And there's like a really big star there too. Oh my gosh, I almost ran somebody over. Are we all checked in? Checked in, check. Checked. Well, honestly, low-key don't really recommend going to be your guest during fireworks, obviously, because then you won't be able to see fireworks. But if fireworks, you know, are something you don't care about, then be your guest or be our guest. There was many reservations for like 7.30 to 9. Yeah, a lot. Yeah. A lot of people don't really like it. So if you need a food, obviously be your guest is going to have you at night because a lot of people don't really book it. And again, it's vibey at night. But it is with a price tag. Price tag of $70 because uh, of the beast. And just because it's be your guest. You can get that at Guys, Epcot. Guys, they have Don Perry on for $590, but you can get that at Epcot for $60. What a bargain. Is that just the gloss on it? The bottle the, is no, I know $5.90. Oh, yeah, it's $60. $60. For the gloss. Yeah. But this is the whole bottle. Yeah. So you're so saying go big or go home? home? Yeah, you might as well. Oh, you want it like this? Aww. Good evening. Bring us a message. They don't really actually tell people not to walk here anymore, so anybody can freely just come on this bridge, by the way. You don't have to have a reservation. They used to do that when they actually just reopened from the pandemic, but if you want to take pictures, you can freely just walk in here and possibly might even able to just walk on into the restaurant too. Don't quote me on that, I don't know if they do that, but yeah. It's beautiful. I think I prefer it at night. What? On, probably yeah, I think for their the, pictures. Yeah, for the pictures, yeah. yeah. But it stays off. Here they come, watch watch the light goes on. And we dig 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 dig. Are Wait. they coming? Here they go. Whoa! <laughs> Gotta get that photo pass. Didn't get, didn't really catch it on camera, but Alexa literally just stopped mid-sentence and walked away from us. Yay! She wants to go on in and eat. Are we ready? Yeah. Oh, that's. Oh, really? Oh. Thank you. And in we go. This is gonna be my first time with my new camera. Probably the best time I've ever been able to document this. And I think, do we go to the right right away to go meet the beast? I'm unsure. That's how they used to do it for dinner. It doesn't look like that. It's my first time with the, the nice camera. You'll get some food. Yeah, I can't wait. I wonder where we're gonna be eating. Where do you want to eat? Like if you if you could pick where we I think the main one right here. Yeah, yeah the next <laughs> should be like we don't wanna eat here. This welcomes the honey cut party. That is not us. It's funny because there's like five checkpoints when you come in and eat here. You have to check on in on the app, then you have to get your text message, then you have to see someone at the door, and then you have to sit in here and wait for your name to get called again. So when you come here, don't be alarmed. There's just a lot of checkpoints. And for the first time ever, I've never seen this mural with nobody in front of it taking pictures. You guys can go ahead, sorry. And we've been called. It's really quick, at least in our case it was. She offered if we want to go right to our table, and we said we'd love to go right to our table because usually they'll actually give you a little tour. But I think we're going to be dining actually in here. And by the way, those are Imagineers or Imagineers babies up there. Fun fact. Are we right here? Let's go! 
So the bell is, <laughs> the beast is supposed to come around, but we just got where he might be with Belle tonight. He's got to take care of his woman. That is priorities right here. I think that's an acceptable answer. Real quick before we order, since I do have my new camera here, it's high resolution 4K. This is the best I've ever seen it. I do want to do a walking tour of uh, be our guest here real quick because we're here in the ballroom at the moment. The, la the largest room and probably the most noisiest. And it actually snows outside straight ahead of us if you can't see that. And then we got the, the west wing to the left. I'm going to go in here. This is the dark area, which I've never been able to document at all, like, well. So let's go into the west room. This is, this is a cool area. Another cool one. It's just so cool. Beautiful. And without doubt, the best I've ever recorded it. Without a doubt. So this is also what you're paying for when you come to be your guest. Most of you guys know, but we got a lot of new subscribers recently. Beer guest, seventy dollars. I believe it's no matter what time it is, it's always seventy dollars. Except for breakfast, I think breakfast is like forty-five. Oh my gosh, did we just witness a pedal fall? You see that? I think the pedal fell. And out of the west wing, we go back into the ballroom. Now, honestly, I forgot what this is called over here. But it's everybody's least favorite, by far. And I actually just ran into some of you guys. It's always fun, especially when you guys are dining. But here's the other room. Not really, not really the best one. I think that the first time I ate here, I was in here. It's not like terrible, but it's like, you know, compared to the other ones. Obviously not comparable. But you do have Beast and the Bell spinning in the middle right there. And here's the Beast and Bell. Sweet. All right, it just came to me. This is, I believe, uh, the Rose Gallery. Comment down below if you guys, uh, or if I'm right, or if I'm wrong, comment down below what it is. I got permission to leave the ladies, so we're gonna go back to them right now. I'm back, did you miss me? I did. Did you miss me? Check out this, this actually isn't even like on the menu online, but you see these enchantments? You can add pork belly with red onion jam on any entree for $10. Not jam. Red onion jam. Oh. Yeah. I thought it was just on there, there's jam. Lex and I might get another fight again if she doesn't believe me. <laughs> Always. She never believes me. You're lying. I don't believe you. You think I'm lying? Yeah. I am lying. Yeah, I'm lying. I have to stay neutral. She's, uh, Switzerland. I am. If this video gets 5,000 likes, we'll come back and purchase a $590 bottle of Don Perignon. If you're gonna drink an expensive champagne like that, don't drink it at Be Your Guess. <laughs> like, go to Victoria and Alfred's. That is a good point. That's a very good point. You can hear the fireworks. If you just imagine, it's like you're actually watching them. Yeah, if you like swing your eyes and look at the chandeliers, it's like a firework. Honestly, yeah. Yeah. Let the take you know, I don't know why I've ever said this, but it'd be really cool to eat up on the balcony or like if Beast and Belle actually went up there, that'd be pretty cool. But it's just for show. It's just for show. It's okay, Tim. Tim, it's my Friday. We appreciate you. We got some rolls. They're all the same. And some sea salt butter. Just give it a nice little bite. It's a nice warm, warm roll. All right, Alexa, rate the bread. We haven't really heard of much from Alexa on food, and we're in a good place for food right now. I give the bread a five. It's warm. That's about it. I haven't really tried it yet because I was talking to our server. We had a nice conversation. We just got a magical moment. Check this out. We got the gray stuff before food came out. This is actually part of the dessert. 
but it's in the form of Mickey. Bon Appetit. Is that... Yeah. It's about the same as Disneyland's. Pretty cool. Um, thank you. I think her name was Michelle for bringing this over. I feel like this is better than Disneyland's. Anyways, it's gray stuff. It's amazing. Super cool. Did not expect us to get gray stuff before anything actually came out besides the rolls. The beast has arrived. I guess I guess Belle is fine to be on her own tonight. He arrives. There he is! The beast! I'm gonna get up. Here he comes, he's just walking down the street, singing do what diddy diddy dum diddy do. Oh, that's cool. Rawr. That's why you pay $70. All right, it looks like our appetizers have arrived and we all got the French onion soup, the only way to do it. All right, I'm only gonna say this once, I'm gonna say it twice, I feel like there's not as much cheese. <laughs> I'm only gonna say this once and I'm gonna say it twice. <laughs> I feel like there used to be more cheese. Like it used to be over the the top, but oh well. It's good, it's a must get here. Some pretty good salty French onion soup. Could do more cheese. I got the filet mignon. I got squash, but I think it was butternut squash. It's the plant-based option, it has eggplant. And that what really sold me is that there's a Kalamata olive tapenade on sourdough toast. So like, I had to do it. It just, it looks and smells amazing. And then I got the lovely pork chop. My goodness, this is gonna go right to my stomach. With the pork belly on top. Oh yeah, and the pork belly, right there. This is, wow. This is $10 right there. Right here, $10. Can you guys believe that? I gotta try the $10 pork belly on, on camera. We're just gonna go like this. With the jam. Honestly, that's just okay. I feel like that pork belly's been sitting for a little bit. So this doesn't melt in your mouth. I'd say skip the pork belly. First few bites of the pork chop. It's good, it's got a lot of flavor in it. How's yours, Case? This is a really good plant-based option. There's a lot of flavor. I can taste a lot of garlic, which I love. Really good. I'm. Honestly, very impressed with this. It's worth seventy dollars if you stop twice. What a bargain! Thirty-five dollars for each appearance. Soup and a free dinner. An almond macaron with some raspberry in between, and we've got the gray stuff. Don't believe me? Ask the dishes. And what was this? It was uh, chocolate in. Golden and, and hazelnut. That was a very good experience. Yeah, I liked it better this time than the last time I was here. The food was better. I enjoyed my steak. It was perfectly done, and we had a great server and great people here. Lots of great cast members here. Yeah. Shout out to Tim and Michelle. Yes. Tim and Michelle, A plus. Looks like they turned this room into like just like a seating room. That's actually how I used to order if anybody remembers back in the day. And now it's just kind of like a, a place where people are just sitting. It's interesting. The girls are using the restroom and uh, it's really nice to see this place kind of empty over here. Well, the group has decided to walk this way. That can only mean one attraction we're going on. What is it? You guys will find out right now. If you guess Dumbo, you guess correct. Fun fact, Alexa cried on this when she was like, I think 12 years old. She was 12 years old. Who knows, maybe she was even 30. She was just so scared. Oh no. I really want to go in there and play. Come no crying. Oh, she's crying. <laughs> -hee -hee. Alexa's crying. <laughs> Hi. Dumbo! I'm lifting up and it's not. Oh, there we go. There we go. There we go. <laughs> 
<laughs> it's honestly just really satisfying. There's Alexa. Hi. Hi. <laughs> it's cool to see Tomorrowland up here too. Bye. 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 We're on Mine Train, and we got the front. Oh boy. I know, I'm by myself. What's wrong? Just so sad. Why? Because it's my last time seeing the pumpkins. That like Christmas is coming. <laughs> Until next year, pumpkins. Until next year. If you know our family, you know we love popcorn, and Alexa is getting her custom popcorn. Here comes Alexa. Nope, making her. Hi. <laughs> Steps and she stuck onto my foot and I'm hugging her. Came out, she's like, give me a hug. I'm like, okay. What is going on? We just met she's one so of you and she was literally awesome. She was super cool. If you know, if you're watching, you know who you are. I but like um, you and her would jive very well together. Um, <laughs> yo, her energy in the vlog was like, she was great. Um, with that, that's going to be it for you guys' Daily Dose, everybody. We'll see you guys tomorrow. I think, this is, real soon. I think this is the only time you're going to be in Magic. Yeah, probably. Sad. Very sad. Bye-bye. What a great night. Bing bong.